Hi guys, this is Desi, and um, I just wanted to give you guys a little quick um, tutorial on 3D Stroke, because a lot of people have been asking me, and um, yeah, so let's get started. So first of all, you just want to find where you want to start it. So I just um, twisted this part out. Alright, so um, just want to go to start, and then you just want to go to layer, no, solid, black layer. And then you want to set this black layer to add. So I'm just going to name this 3, 3D stroke layer. <clears throat> and then I'm just going to cut it. Make sure it's all lined up. Alright, so I'm just going to click on the black layer. Go to effect, trap code, 3D stroke. And then from there, you just want to keyframe start and offset. Then you want to go to taper and enable taper. And then you could like choose the color that you want here. I like to do that after I've done my stroke. So um, I'm just going to grab your pen tool and you're just going to sketch around where you want it to happen. And then it creates this little layer thing just click on that you can extend it make it bigger wider smaller that's how you get the full effect that's how you make it look really nice um so it's gonna set it to about right here let's move this you might want to bring up the thickness a little bit when you're using this I don't know it's your it's all your opinion it all comes from your creativity on what you want to do just gonna add, put a little thickness up, and then just gonna change the color. I like like this light blue, and then you have your basic stroke. Now to make it like go around to warp, you're just gonna since you have these keyframed already, you want to go to where it's gonna end, and then you're gonna set the offset to a hundred, and then you want to go to like the middle of the clip the middle of the of it and then you want to set it the end to about 45 and then you just want to set the start you want to put that at about 20 whatever whatever you like matter of fact it's not even mine just low and then you have your basic stroke there's so many different things that you could do with um 3D stroke. It all comes from creativity on what you want to do, to be honest. Like, I have no control. I could give you a lot of stuff. I could give you overlays to use. And you have your basic stroke. You might want to make it a little bit thinner, though. Not like this thin. Maybe about 20, 23. That's a good idea. <clears throat> and that's your basic stroke, guys. Um, I'd give you some overlays if you want. I have like a shot. Give you some overlays. This one. So like when you shoot. And then like you could just like work with the effects a little bit. Let's go this right here. Move this in a little bit. Hello. Hello. And you could just work with the effects here. So if it's like shooting this way, I like to toggle switches of mode set this to a 3d layer and i just like to make this about 180 i like to scale it up a little bit and then just go to position and set it up <coughs> and then you have the basics <coughs> And that's the basics of 3D Stroke. I can give you guys so many overlays. If you want them, send them to me. Just leave it in the comment. I'll send them to you through a PM. Um, and that's basically it, guys. Um, if you need anything else from me, I'll be happy to let you have it or give you another tutorial for it. And that's it. Thanks, guys. Peace.